Hello everyone, this is Jeff of Tau Flavor Mouse. In this video, we're going to interact two very dissimilar fluids, corn syrup and the liquid metal mercury. Now, I believe most people understand the dangers of mercury, and it's something you really don't want to play with. And of course, we use every precaution and safety uh, equipment when we're handling this, so don't freak out too much. Now corn syrup is unique because it has a very high viscosity, at least a thousand times thicker than water, yet it has a very low density, only about 1.4 times the density of water. The first thing we're going to do is drop a steel pachinko ball into our corn syrup to see how that interacts. Next we'll use the mercury and we're using a syringe to kind of drizzle it over the surface of the corn syrup in small droplets. Now the characteristics of mercury is very opposite to that of corn syrup. The density of mercury is very high, about 13 and a half times the density of water. But the weird thing that a lot of people don't understand is that the viscosity of mercury is actually very low. Uh, and it all depends on the temperatures of the fluids, but it's just slightly more viscous than water. As you can see, a lot of air bubbles are entrapped in the corn syrup. Uh, the smaller the bubbles, the slower they are at rising. Just like the larger globules of mercury fell a lot faster than the small ones. But we have a lot of air slowly rising out of this. Now next we'll add some red food coloring to the top of this and see how that interacts. Just kind of like a Halloween theme, I guess. Now, instead of using the syringe, we're just gonna pour it in in big globules, and you can see how much quicker the blobs of mercury drop as they fall through the corn syrup. Now like many of my videos, they are driven by viewer suggestions. I want to thank you guys for all your imaginative ideas. I really do not do anything with Facebook or Twitter. I focus primarily on YouTube and I try to re reply to as many comments and questions as possible. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this.